and girls. So I'm going to cover a few cool combos and exercises that you might not have seen before. Uh, these are things that we're doing in our Cavemen in a Circle. You might have heard about it. It's a private group where and we do uh, weekly workouts live, but uh, afterwards you can see them. So full length, it's got everything like technique, alternatives, progressions. You can ask questions, there's coaching. It's less than uh, $7 a week. You should check it out, the Caveman in a Circle on cavemantraining.com. But um, even if you don't join, just uh, enjoy these uh, little exercises and combos here. If you appreciate them, just uh, leave a comment below and share it. Um, I'm going to put these out as uh, several different videos on the channel. So per video, you'll only see one exercise or combo. So make sure you check out the other ones. Uh, it's pretty cool, this stuff. Uh, I can guarantee you haven't seen it anywhere else before. So check it out. All right, so one of the things we did today in our Caveman in the Circle live online workout was uh, a burpee deadlift hang snatch reverse overhead lunge for six minutes AMRAP. Um, that looks like this. So a proper burpee is just squat. Actually, the, the, the real burpee was more like this and you fold your knees under yourself, but that puts a lot of pressure on your lower back. It was also not intended for uh, uh, high reps. So the adjustment is here, a squat, and it's perfectly fine for high reps if you do it good. I mean, I've done 500 in one session. I've done thousands with clients and they're all good. As long as you do the burpee good, the burpee is a good exercise. So here is how to do it. Fold, squat, hands down, uh, hips up, then kick your legs out in plank position, then pull your butt up and pull your feet under. So that's a proper burpee. Now we're going to do that with the kettlebell. So you want to be close to the kettlebell because you don't want to be reaching out for it. So we're going to do one burpee, one deadlift, and then a hang snatch in overhead reverse lunge. All right, the ground is a bit wet, so I'll get muddy hands, but we'll ignore that. So I'm just right behind the kettlebell, squat position, hands down, lats on, triceps on, chest active, hips up, kick the feet back, plank position, pull them back in. Watch how I'm next to the kettlebell, I look ahead. I only put one hand on the kettlebell, we're working with one hand. So I deadlift it up. So it's a deadlift with a squat movement. A deadlift is lifting a dead weight. Can be different types of uh, movement patterns. All right, so I just deadlifted it. Now I'm gonna go into a hang snatch. So I'm gonna drop down into a hang and snatch it overhead. Then I keep it overhead with a good lockout. I bring my right foot in line with my hip and I lunge back. Gently tap the ground, back up. Rack it, get to the ground, another burpee, other hand, deadlift. Hang snatch, keep it overhead, reverse lunge. Rack it, get to the ground. And that's what we did today in our workout. There's more to it. If you're interested in this kind of stuff and have something new each week, come and join the Caveman in a Circle. Link below. This is the secret book, our kettlebell workout book. This is where we design all our workouts in. We have a whole book like that, or two or three actually, and they're completely full. This one is a double kettlebell, four minute EMOM, clean and squat under into push press, three minute EMOM, gorilla cleans, five minute stretching. We like to include stretching a lot in our workouts, mobility work. Uh, we do good warm ups. Uh, not all the warm-ups are written down, but we always do a warm-up before uh, every workout and we cover technique too. So this one is where we work for 30 seconds squats, 30 seconds cross mountain, 30 seconds jumping jack, 30 seconds push up, 30 seconds rest, two rounds. That was just body weight as a warm-up. 
Then we got Caveman ROM, which is uh, Caveman Range of Motion, working on uh, flexibility and strength. Uh, this was the Turkish getup that we broke down step by step. Then even stretching in here, and then curl. We like to include the curl a lot. We got ribbons into twist, alternating hand clean and press, a military press combo, finish with max hand clean and press on each side. So we go for endurance, muscular endurance, uh, cardio and strength here. That's one we did today, and it goes on.